Hi, I'm Ed Brooks with Rome Bio Paints. I'm with the operations manager of our facility in Atlanta, and we're here working on this particular home today, showing you how to create natural distress looks using the Venetian glaze on natural stone. using the masonry brushes, the better brush to use. There are cheaper brushes on the market, but this brush is designed for our product. And number two, it's still a great brush, but it also does not wear out on the grout marks as a traditional cheaper brush would. And being sure that you wanna make sure you really work the product to the cracks and crevices in any chipped away areas. So you really work that in very well. You're not trying to achieve a painted look, and so, you just constantly be working it into the surface. I have not had to dip into the bucket too often because this brush has great pickup and it has great release, which most professional contractors prefer because there's less labor of going back and forth to the bucket and the brush is putting the product on the surface. So you maximize your work time and labor time as well. And through all that rough surface, the brush is still in great shape. Now, as you can see from the before and the after, you can now see that we got a finished project here. Uh, the paint is completely dry. There's nothing rubbing off. But the greatest thing about this whole finish is the stone still looks like natural stone. You see some highlights here, and you see some places where, where we have a little bit of pigment on it right here, and then you see some natural stone that's coming through all together. But so the whole thing here, even with the mortar, you see a slight color movement in the mortar, just a natural movement. So the whole process does not look painted or tried to create but actually the product itself created a natural look. Mm -hmm. 